No. No, no, no. Stop the music. Stop it. That's not what I was talking about, Tony. Okay? Okay, don't pay no attention to him. Uh, don't pay no attention to that music, because that ain't what we're talking about. I'm talking about a moray. Okay? And I'm going to show you how to fix it in this video. Okay? This is the part where you fade me the black and roll the intro in. Okay? Just do it. Well, that was rather fun, I thought. I hope you enjoyed it. Anyway, we're going to talk about Moray. And uh, if you're not familiar with it, Moray is, I, I'm sure you've seen it. If you have uh, horizontal lines, like shingles on a roof or bricks in a wall, uh, sometimes they will have kind of a wavy or a rippled look to them, like they're moving around a little bit, like there's a wave going across them. And uh, that's moray. Now, we want to eliminate that if possible, but let me give you an example uh, that I shot just a few minutes ago of my roof and pay particular attention to the highest portion and the part of the roof that's facing the camera. Uh, near the top, you'll see some rippling or waving going on. So here's that footage. In this next sequence, uh, I went into the camera settings and uh, I changed my style. I think it's the style portion that you can, uh, the page that you can use, D-Log or d like or whatever. Down at the bottom there's a custom setting. And I reduced the sharpness to negative 2. I reduced the contrast to negative 2 and the saturation to negative 2. And look at the difference that that small uh, adjustment makes. Here's that uh, same roof with another uh, bit of footage. It's not perfect, obviously. I could go back and decrease the contrast to negative three and that would probably improve it uh, another third or so. But uh, Anyway, you can get rid of uh, the majority of that moray uh, by making some minor camera adjustments and uh, trying it a second time. So, I think that's it for today. Um, I believe that's all. And uh, until I speak with you... Oh, if you've got any questions or any comments, leave them down below. And uh, I'll be more than happy to answer them. So uh, I think that's it. Oh, I've got some uh, training videos that I'm going to be doing in the next week or so. So uh, keep an eye open for those. And also, don't forget to enter my drone giveaway. I'll put a link uh, down below uh, so you can enter that. And I think that's it. So until I speak with you again and even after that, you stay focused.